Hello everyone, Snack here, this time bringing you a brewing tycoon set in a monastery which promises a smooth mix of concocting ales while building out your monastery. And it's as simple as brew, sip, and repeat. Welcome to Ale Abbey. Let's try out this game, guys. Oh, your maltiness, you finally arrived. Welcome to Ale Abbey, the monastery of the Fermentine Order. <laughs> wow, this is funny. Uh, I am Brother Maltus, and also his name, it's Malt. Maltus, <laughs> your appointed counselor. Uh, together we're going to make brewing history don't worry i will have your back in those first steps it's easier sound it's easier than it sounds let's get started yep brother maltis let's go what do we have here in just to inspect your monastery please move the camera around with wasd or holding and dragging using the right mouse button Okay, yeah, it's better to, to just drag it. Okay, it uh, looks like, yep, indeed, we are in a ministry. As you can see, there's a nun here. Oh, we could actually zoom in and out. So double click on the, in the room to zoom in uh, in it and uh, center. Okay, there you go. There's a nun here and uh, a monk. And it looks like the bell is ringing. Okay, you can change the game speed or even pause it by using the console in the right upper corner of the screen. So it's here. Uh, just making sure you can work at your own pace. Okay, congratulations. Yep, okay. Let's see what will happen here. So at the left side, we have here like a task. Uh, we have the bishop. Well, we finally made it. Never thought they'd need a bishop all the way here. Oh, hello. I don't usually prefer fan fanfare. But it's always nice to have a welcoming committee. Now let's skip the small talk. I'm here to make sure the clergy is handled and our local interests are are in check. The ministry looks decent, but we can do better. I'll oversee management, direct, and at times demand. Off you go now. I have some serious pounding to do. Understood. Okay. So we do have a task here to expand our holy brewing mission. <laughs> we need Florence, and for that we need to sell ale. We don't know many styles yet, so we can keep it simple. Let's whip up a drinkable light ale. Perfect for this hot spring. Oh, I am parched just thinking about it. <laughs> okay, so uh, we need to build a recipe desk and create a light pale ale to get 100 florins. All right, to create a new recipe, you need to place a desk on, in the library and use it as a start of creation process. So where is this a library looks like she's happy with by herself she's like singing oh the library is here all right so we need to uh build a uh recipe disc oh there you go it should be here down all right there you go haha <laughs> nice now we need to create a light pale ale okay remember to start a new recipe from scratch or use an old one as your basis select the style of your ale select the ingredients decide to develop uh, the developer fermentine and library to use name the recipe and commence development oh it's like really um there are no pre-made uh, recipes first we need to create the recipe and top of that we get to name our recipe which is definitely fun just like the name brother maltus so yeah th that's the charm of this game i think it will make you think and uh let's let's do this man please seal the hops container after using it or they will lose all aroma okay sure brother maltus okay time to create a recipe uh light ale there you go so we have here uh like three uh pages so we have a description thin and nearly flavorless nevertheless a lot healthier and fun to drink compared to warm water very easy to drink accompanying a meal nice i like this okay at the left side we have here flavor the flavor of a brew defined by an array of delicious facilities and uh, subject to a hopefully unparalleled complexity and richness the color of an ale almost exclusively affected by the malt used from a light straw blonde to ruby red and almost black strength the strength of the brew in terms of alcohol will it suffice for the hardy locals okay and then uh, next the foam the foam's quality tells you if a uh, served a beer looks flat or is snugly covered by a thick layer of cloudy goodness so the, cl the cloudy it is the better right okay now we have here quality range okay oh these are virtues here right 
Yep, these are virtues. It's foamy. Okay, and the ingredients we have here is uh, malt and uh, standard yeast. Uh, okay, okay. At the bottom part, we have the 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 next uh, page here. Okay, we need one malt and one standard yeast. If we add more uh, pale malt, oh yeah, the more pale malt we add. Ah, I see. Okay. So the, the the more in the 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 type of of virtue these guys here that you want to achieve depends on uh what how many what how do you how you arrange the ingredients out and how how much you put in it so if i add a pale malt it will look like this and if i add a standard yeast it will balance things out okay so um the perfect combination would be uh first we need to go with the flavor so if we uh add uh, just the standard yeast it will just add this uh flavor right here and if we add this pale malt it will balance everything and it will increase more the strength okay okay this looks good uh if you notice here uh th there's a uh an indicator here right here if you if you remove one um the indicator will turn red i'm not sure but uh i think the best mix is to have these indicators right here to go all green to get its perfect balance so to achieve that we need a standard yeast two of it and uh four uh pale malt if i'm not mistaken anyway let's do this oh this is cool we could also select a brewer so we have a latte erica oblate oblate and some okay uh intelligence bonus plus two and plus one um intelligence oh this this uh erica should do the job well okay uh we have here the room that we just uh, added the recipe desk uh we can't edit it here uh all right i think we are ready you guys so we're gonna be just to, just to recap are uh, we gonna be crafting or brewing a light ale with uh two standard yeast and four pale malt as an ingredient and erica is gonna brew it for us in the library let's go ahead with that your maltiness maltiness please review your recipes name it properly and confirm to start the development process <laughs> we could also name it this is fun otherwise cancel okay i'm a person who always uh look for alibi so alibi <laughs> i'm not sure I, I don't know so corny but anyway all right that should do it okay oh oh wait uh, uh my mistake i thought we were brewing but this, we were just in the recipe creation process let me correct that oh boy this is fun it's most uh, brewing or crafting games you already have the recipe you all just you just need to craft it but in this game you need to create the recipe and name it and then i think there's a time we could craft or brew it and it looks like uh, we have here erica busy uh creating the recipe and uh, meanwhile we have the bishop right here checking everything is doing great and uh, the merchant is happy even though no one's buying from his store we also have here um uh anselm anselmo i forgot his name and look at this uh looks like we have a lot of space that we could uh utilize to to expand our uh brewery business or mission <laughs> okay uh, we have the brewery right here i'm guessing this is where we're gonna be placing uh our uh whatever is the whole it's called the whatever the 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 furniture is used for a uh, brewery brewery <laughs> man okay it looks like uh oblate or oblate Ob I, I don't know let me let me just google it one moment okay uh yeah uh google pronunciation says it's oblate okay that's good so now um Oh, we've received a hundred florins. Thank you, Mr. Uh, Sir Bishop. And looks like they're asleep uh, on the floor. Poor guys. Oh, man. We should craft a bed first, you know, or uh, of some sort. I expected bird song and nature's peace, but instead it's murmuring, wailing, and snoring. This has to stop. Find your brewers a proper place to sleep or I lose my mind and no floors won't, don't count, no matter how fancy. For the love of hopes, hops... <laughs> build a dormitory with beds for these poor souls yep <laughs> they'll thank you and so will i okay a dormitory and a bunk bed so we have here under dormitory tab we have a uh bank bed no available positions uh, uh oh first we need to build a dormitory first uh just a minute so we need to build uh rooms first and this is the dormitory okay Oh, we could do it like this. All right, awesome. So, um, the 
brewery is gonna be a bit noisy because uh there's gonna be machines doing its thing i think we're gonna put the the dormitory here as there's no noise in scribbling recipes right okay looks like this lady here is working very hard for our dormitory i can't wait for up late erica and 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 some to have good rest in our dormitory oh i forgot we could actually uh press at the upper corner we could um speed up the game okay our dormitory is ready time to build a bed and there you go our first uh, bunk bed uh let's put lockers okay that should be perfect that should make them happy and another 100 florins thank you bishop oh we've completed our uh, light ale alibi <laughs> just to be more specific we've completed the recipe so look at this um oh i like this one this is uh all the virtues if you see here these are the virtues which are the flavor strength color foam uh they're all balanced out all plus five uh except for fermentine which i'm not sure what it is really uh as long as it's it's a positive plus two not negative so i think I'm, i am fine with it and all right i can't wait to brew our very first uh ale this is where we should do it uh the time has come your maltiness to brew your version of ambrosia uh set up a brewery with a boiler and a fermentor instruct a brewer on how to wash their hands and leave them to it pick any a recipe you like i'm eager to see if anything i heard about your brewing prowess is true so we need to build a basic brewing stove basic fermenter and uh, brew the ale for 150 florins and one fame all right let's go okay by the way guys uh, there are icons here below but if you go to each room uh you can actually see it here uh it will be easier to navigate or if you just quickly press it here it will bring you directly to the 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 appliances that i don't know is it called appliances it's old school right i don't know uh, it's called appliances it will bring you to these appliances where you could build the uh, in the brewery so we need uh, stove okay stove is gonna go straight here uh basic fermenter that should do it ups bus basket okay we'll put it here and all right so in the stove we can make a we can brew alibi right now okay nice uh who can brew uh since erica already made the recipe let's let um unsem brew do the brewing okay okay we could uh brew the maximum amount of it okay when you brew you automatically buy ingredients at your current prices oh okay um we cannot just move maximum amount because it will automatically buy the ingredients uh let's see how much money we have we have like 600 that's fine we'll be spending only 150 so in the full game and once you build a storage room you will be able to buy discounted ingredients from the merchant in advance to maximize your profits okay let's go with this hey and brew okay let's see oh yep yep that one's here delivered the ingredients and looks like a blade uh a blade and some is working on it and looks like what hold on is he mad or something oh he's going to sleep okay and we have here uh the other nun okay let's just move forward a bit looks like they're soundly asleep they're waking up now and uh yep he is now brewing ah oh, it smells so good while we wait what should we do uh well, okay we'll, we'll make a new recipe while we wait uh we have a recipe for the light ale okay uh it seems that we only have uh, one style for now which is the light ale recipe so uh yep uh we'll just leave it be how about a new recipe create from an existing ah it's, it's a lock okay we need to research it first oh there's a research tree i think uh where can we see that i want to take a look oh go research okay so we have here ale studies okay pretty much basic stuff but i'm glad that uh, we have this system because uh it will just uh you know it will uh deliver uh, a fun play style because you get to think on how you upgrade your stuff so you get the desired results that you have in mind we also have here economy this is fun okay i like this markets and economy and fermentines and stuff okay haha larger transport team faster learning experience maintain locker and architecture and engineering uh building time okay that looks good and in the meantime oh our light ale is almost done and in three two one haha good job of light and some oh uh, okay he's still gonna uh ferment it i'm sorry about that 
let's just speed up oh oh i'm done with the work but i'm gonna finish it tomorrow because i'm he's about to sleep <laughs> and on the next day back to work in three two one i'm done <laughs> all right what's the score is this the score why it's so low oh your multiness we could have done better but we could have done worse i guess the ansem's alibi has a ma major quality of 10 out of 100 oh that's so bad i thought we did it right and we've crafted or brewed a bunch of them but that's fine it's their first try so okay each market is only interested in specific ale styles by meeting their demands uh you'll grow your reputation and unlock new markets and challenges for now only one market is available sell your ale there hop for hop fender <laughs> what fun names this game has okay uh at the left side right here um okay looks like hopfenderf is a poor poor town or village uh they have a tiny population uh delivery distance is two days okay okay uh let's see if we increase the price a bit fair price is 25 okay uh okay so if we increase the price uh, at this uh side right here at the left it will respond accordingly if we increase it they will be mad there's gonna be no appeal but i want them to be happy this one right here 26 I, I don't want them to just meh okay it's an ale um i just want i want them to be happy with our product so it should be there you go 22 how about lowering it down oh very happy <laughs> uh, no no i need to profit as well i think this is enough so it's gonna be 23 gold and we're gonna sell it all right oh we have these uh lovely ladies here i think they're gonna deliver our product now or our ale this guy here all right take care sir you do have a fruitful journey bring home the bacon okay uh we could also uh put globe uh the boundless known world as others have experienced it not you you get seller duty again <laughs> okay uh, what does this do uh globe move sell uh nada okay um all right we got ourselves 150 florins and uh plus one fame not bad i can't wait for us to be able to <laughs> um make another uh style of recipe for now we only have light ale okay the bishop listens a prayer ale and faith are great but your brewers can't live in spirits alone sure they could cook but we need them focused on brewing so let's find someone to handle their meals oh nice this is cool oh geez okay it's a dull task but it if we build a refectory and properly equip it a volunteer will surely step in free of charge naturally oh this is this is fun yes I, I always wanted a place or a game that would not just let you brew and craft but also you know just like irl it would uh you have to do some uh basic stuff as well like cooking hopefully there is cleaning as well is it gonna be fun for me uh hold on uh now i forgot to, okay we need to i think we need to build a room first refectory okay uh it should be right here all right and our refectory is done we now uh place this dining table and a cooking stove just right here and someone just volunteered nice nice gonna be they're gonna be very happy right good food will make their hearts warm and and a warm and a happy heart always produces good works right hopefully good ale in a, in this case so we have 150 florins from that awesome okay uh let's see cooking stove move nope i think it's automated okay uh the brewing tethers ethers or tethers i don't know how to pronounce it but as to tradition but there is progress to be made still that's our latest directive i don't know what cosmic revelations can be extracted from toying around for ingredients alas stranger things can have happened so we march forward so build a laboratorium equip it staff it hope for the best i think this is where we can experiment i think so okay laboratorium a yeah laboratorium okay uh, let's just go ahead and place this laboratorium uh here okay it looks like it's almost done and there you go oh it looks like we don't have enough uh florins to establish an escritore uh we'll have to wait i think once we get our ale sold get uh, some some uh, money for us to lay down that uh this this one right here escritor okay i would like to see them eat and have fun here at least there's an animation for that because otherwise this this is just 
like a, an artificial decorative plant for me, which I don't appreciate. I think she's just doing something. At least this guy. And Sam, you could go ahead and eat while we wait. Nope. Nope, not happening. Okay, uh, let's... Oh, okay, let me correct myself. Look at this, guys. Haha, <laughs> they're actually sitting down, having a good meal. All right, looks, this looks good. I like it. And look at that. If you look at the upper left-hand corner, we have 200 gold. I think this is from the... Uh, from the, uh, light ale we've sold. And finally, we could place down this, uh, the guy right here. It's hard to pronounce his name. Iskritore. Uh, assign. Oh, we could assign one here. Erica is going to be working on the recipe plus the research. Paperwork, right? Okay. Okay. We've received 100 florins and, uh, one fame from that. Okay. If you look at the lower left-hand corner, we have enough res research points to unlock new technologies. Nice. Let's check it out. Open brewing in development. What? She's not happy with it? Uh, that's fine. What's Abbott's? But we have candidates right here. Oh, we could actually hire more people. This is fun. Okay. Uh, Postulant Elisaria seems to have uh, balanced uh, stats. Intelligence, intuition, um, productivity, uh, satisfaction, and drunkenness. Oh, this is, this is, this is funny. Like we are in a monastery. We're brewing, uh, ale. And of course you're going to drink their own product, right? <laughs> they have to test it first. Okay. Uh, do we need to hire new staff? I'm not sure. Uh, let's see. Okay. Let's just follow Bishop Superior. As esteemed as it may be, our monastery has begun accumulating character. Dust bunnies the size of pilgrims are gathering in the corners and the refectory floor is now more litter than stone. We're in a dire need of maintenance locker. Research how to build it and grace us with its presence. Maintenance uh, locker. Okay, um, there it is. Under research. Okay, we need to hold left click. And yep, we got it researched, I think. And then we need to build one, of course. Let's see which room we could build it. Oh, hey, look at this. Oh man, I just mentioned right that that it would be nice if aside from the cooking simulation and the brewing one, uh, of course there's gonna be mess all around and I can see it heat here right now. It's so messy. So it seems that uh, yeah we get uh, and a chance to clean up the mess as well, which is I like. Uh, maintenance locker holds the necessary tools to keep the monastery spotless. Also looks sturdy and menacing enough to put the fear of cleanliness in you. <laughs> Oh man. All right. Uh, let's put it right here. There you go. And a clean, clean, a uh, refractory. Okay. How could we clean? How could we clean it? Oops. Okay. Uh, uh, how to clean it? Do I need to do something or is it, uh, automated? Oh, here you go. At the, uh, lower right hand corner, as you can see, there's, there's a little icon here, a broom. Maybe this will do. Oh, oh, okay. Hold on. Okay. It's doing something. It seems. Oh, uh, no. Ah, oh, all right. There you go. So just have to drag it here. I think. Drag the icon, broom icon, to any room that needs cleaning, and it will do it auto automatically. How about this uh, lamp here? Does it do anything? Nope. And all right, we've cleaned successfully the refractory. Okay, uh, if you look at the upper left-hand corner, um, we have here the mood of our fermentines. Looks like they are depressed. We've gave them food. They have a place to rest. We've cleaned... Uh, the refractory i'm not sure how we could uh oh i think i know we need uh i guess there's some sort of an entertainment aside from <laughs> the beer that they can drink uh that's what I, my guess is anyway uh multiple lockers will reduce the broom's cooldown oh you can't later automate maintenance task by assuming fermentines to the role of custodians okay that's cool we've got 200 florence and finally they were eating together oh too bad you did not see that it guys it was fun to watch so uh in this case uh the, the more uh maintenance locker the faster we could clean stuff so uh, i would like to add more uh, how much is this this is only oh it's a hundred it's kind of expensive uh let's think about that okay uh much like everyone else i feel the unbearable heat under these habits but i've come up with a solution uh, sellers well tell the clergy it's for the <laughs> Lagers, lagers or laggers, I don't know. Uh, cool temps, long, long term storage. Nobody would come looking and hopefully they'll bite. Oh, it seems that they're doing something that the upper, upper uh, people don't know. 
<laughs> okay, actually, research will make it even more believable. Research sellers and their barrels, and let's start constructions right away. Ah, uh, there's a lot of things we need to do, but that's fine. We will get 150 florins from that. First, we need to research seller in the tech tree. Okay, this is it. Oh, uh, we need to research this, but we need, if you look at the right side, we need uh, 25 uh, research points. We don't have it yet. Uh, I wonder how we could gain research points, right? Oh, I forgot. We should be brewing every day right all right let's go ahead pay and brew oh okay my mistake my mistake oh we, we actually gained uh three more research points so we could now research uh the seller okay and then we need to research uh, the barrel okay this one here which requires 15 research points we only have three for now let's just have to wait and fortunately our the fermentines are, are very depressed uh, i'm not sure how to really uh fix that <laughs> hold on what is this uh can we do we need to clean this okay let's see what will happen oh okay it was a mess good thing we've cleaned it and we have uh at the lower left corner and we have new fermentine candidates available for hire we have postulant crispine higher cost is 10 uh is there a way for us to reset i i kind of don't like his um his stats uh i also want to have a, a higher productivity uh, bar here especially that i'm looking for someone to clean up our monastery uh maybe i'll wait for tomorrow maybe there's more uh candidates suited for the job so anyway sellers are where barrels of ale are stored for future use or are the abbey's internal consumption build a cellar underground to start stacking your ales but i need to research first and going to the brewery looks like we are almost done and there you go that should do it aha nice go ahead and sell it straight to Huffendorf for the same price i want them to be happy and then that should do it off you go and look at this finally we could research the barrel oh hold on research a barrel in the tech tree and that should do it aha and now we need to build a staircase underground staircase is this it yes um oh there it is underground it should be here should be near the brewery for easy delivery all right nice so this week we sold 92 liters of ale for 200 11 florins not bad and look at this you guys at the upper left corner um we have another 233 uh money uh and you know what let's keep on brewing just keep on brewing you guys let's see if we could craft new recipes nope and it seems that they are now awake uh let's see if we have new candidates nope we don't uh you know what let me just hire you let's see where are you ah uh, there he is hello welcome to our little monastery uh, i will be uh, assigning you to clean up and how to do that i don't know as well oh well for now let's focus on the task we need to build a cellar okay uh 450 uh florins so we need to make more money i'm not sure if i i misunderstood because it uh, uh there was an instruction that we could assign someone in the maintenance locker to automatically clean the place without us doing doing this uh, manually so we need to clean this all right the brewery is being cleaned after the refractory let's see and oh oh hold on we need to oh my, my bad we need to build more bed and unfortunately we've overspent in making light ale we don't have enough gold to even craft or build a bunk a bed that is perfectly fine um uh, come on mr unsum you can do it we need money uh and we have new enough research points okay let's just remove the researcher give her a rest and now we could sell our uh we could sell more more of it and all right this should give us more money so we could at least first build a bunk bed and that expensive seller which costs 450 gold oh poor erica looks like she's sleeping again hey guys i thought you're all gentlemen how come you let this woman sleep on the floor ah uh, he's praying and he had, he even have that the nerve to pray right after that okay only 90 gold we need 100 gold to oh excuse me and uh i think we've sold the the other batch of ale but uh where's the money oh currently selling okay we are currently selling the alibi 
fail. Oh, the good thing is that uh, the demand is very high. Oh, if the demand is very high, uh, we could actually uh, increase the, the price, right? But first, let's do some promo. Maybe uh, the price that would that would make them feel uh, like they're buying without being broke. And uh, the next batch, we're gonna slowly adjust uh, the price. Maybe let's set it up to the to, to the standard price, which is 25 gold and then so on. So uh, we can't do and OK, let's just clean up here. OK, let's just assign a researcher. I want to assign. I want to assign Erica. Looks like she has the most intelligent of all. So right now we've got nothing to do. We don't have the gold yet. Let's just uh, uh, skip the day. And we've made 230 florins. Not bad. We now have 300 florins total. If you look at the upper left hand corner. And uh, finally uh, we could uh, build a another a bunk a bed for this poor Erica here. Oh, okay. Hey Erica wake up. We have a new bunk bed for you. Oh looks like she's so sound be asleep. Okay hopefully we'll be able to make it up to her. And at least now if you look up the uh, left side uh our fermentines which are the people that we hired uh at least they're now like they are not that depressed anymore. They're back to normal. But I want them to be happy. Oh we have a uh, wait 40 lit liters of light ale for a withdrawal party at oh okay nice so we have like special requests 40 liters uh why not let's negotiate uh base price 100 only advance payment 50 total payment uh let's go and negotiate first all right here we are we could huggle almost guaranteed hi good so we have to take note you guys light ale is on demand in this part but they are poor but this is a party right this is a special request so the price should also be uh special uh let's go ahead with this we really need money also on our end so we'll just go ahead with the I success so from 100 gold uh we're gonna be getting uh 131 if if this is a successful negotiation for us let's confirm okay congratulations your offer has been accepted you shall wish you shall deliver 40 liters of light ale with a minimum quantity of 12 oh 12 okay to Hopfenderf for 130 florin payment Half of the payment has already been transferred to your treasury and the remaining half will be paid upon the successful delivery. Nice. We need to uh, brew 12 of that. Okay. Uh, this got me confused. Um, uh, let me check again the, the special request. Okay. Uh, quantity 40 liters of uh, light ale. 40. Okay. All right. That should do it. And it says here we have new candidate uh, of late Mancinius. Uh, let's see, he has a decent intelligence, uh, just a decent stats. I don't know, it, his hiring cost is like only five uh, gold, so, and upkeep is one. Okay, let's just, let's just go ahead and hire him, but we need to craft or to build more a table. More table should be perfectly fine here. Wait, hold on, let me just move this. Okay, I'm going to move you here, there. Okay, that is perfect. Table here. Table number two. Let's clean it up. Looks like our monastery is getting dirty now that people are busy working. Uh, it could be time for us to buy more or to, to get more maintenance uh, locker. Because the more maintenance locker we have, the faster this there's a cooldown right if you do like this the faster it will cool down and the problem is it's 110 so uh we'll have to wait i really wanted to build the cellar so we could progress now and look at this they are they're sleeping finally and let's clean this up and we are if you look at the upper right uh, the the brewing process is now at 97 percent any moment now it should be done and we should be able to uh deliver uh this ale to hopfender for the party betrothal party okay uh 40 liters of ale for a betrothal party what the quality is too low not good the quality is too low they're not accepting it oh geez uh the quality should be 12 plus if you see here uh there's a crown with a 12 plus that's a quality it should be 12 plus right uh the one we're selling right now it's it's only uh 10 uh looks like we need to uh craft uh, or to make a new recipe that would increase its quality uh let's just sell what we've uh brewed so far and then uh make a new recipe all right so i'm trying to figure out what's the best uh ratio of the standard yeast and pale malt for us to get at least 12 plus uh quality of a light ale 
uh let's see if you look up here um there's quality above uh if we add pale mouth it will add five i think quality and this is 15 no i'm not sure i don't know i don't know how it works but we'll, we'll just see okay this is the first uh, recipe that we have uh that only reached uh, 10 quality so uh let's start from this as the basis okay we add another pale malt everything went up how about a yeast uh, it went down another pale malt it went up again nice yeast it will go down another pale malt Oh, every time we add pale malt, it will go up. So every time we add uh, yeast, it will add more flavor. However, the strength will go down. If you look at the left side, uh, this is it. Uh, if we remove the yeast, it will add more alcoholic percentage right here. But the flavor will be less. Okay, I just want these guys to be uh, balanced. To be the same, the flavor and the, the strength. And there you go. I want to add more, more pale malt. 10 of it and that should do it let's see if it works this recipe hopefully this recipe will lead us to uh pl 12 plus quality which is required for the betrothal party looks like Unsam's gonna have to take a rest for now <laughs> he's not happy with his uh, job as a brewer uh let's uh, uh let's uh, assign uh postulant crispine this time all right uh it's gonna be ali by the second <laughs> all right there you go. Uh, we have now postulant crispine working on the recipe. Oh, oh, hold on. The market of Hopfenford now has an interest in ales, in ales brewed with the blonde style. Okay, blonde style, res, uh, blonde style, ale style. Okay, uh, we'll work on that. And uh, the recipe is uh, finally finished. Unfortunately, the quality. Uh, I'm not sure if this is gonna work. Still at a. Uh, maximum of 10 uh we'll do a test how about that just the test right i just need uh 10 liters of it and let's check out if we could uh we have a new we could create a new uh style ah uh, yeah bland aisle or ale aha okay the ingredients are pale malt standard yeast and uh gruet one amazingly clear clean and crisp ale that makes any summer day all the more bearable carries a brilliant light color and is very easy to drink with its light aromas and flavors oh special it has 10 percent plus to popularity in summer in all the markets nice oh quality range is uh 5 to 20. okay uh let's make a recipe for this okay let's add one of each let's see what happens if we add this gruet what will happen oh the taste okay let's add some strength let's add one more yeast okay pale malt standard yeast okay i think i'll settle with this uh concoction so it's gonna be a bit uh strong but uh, you know we're brewing alcoholic beverages right so it should be strong uh let's go ahead with this and let's see what will happen ale hoy <laughs> there you go let's see if we need uh up some places to be cleaned up but uh, looks like uh, we're doing a good job in cleaning up our place oops we have some dirt here and how come this uh brewing uh session is taking longer than i expected we only like uh asked him to brew 10 liter liters of light ale uh let's see now uh there's only 10 ah it's the same thing what in the barrel oh we need to put it in a barrel uh not sure oh geez we have 27 days left and so until we get uh we have that uh remaining time for us hopefully we could get a 12 plus quantity of light ale before it ends okay it looks like the price is just uh 20 yeah it's okay let's just sell them okay it's time to test our new uh, uh you know what i'll just keep on uh maybe craft uh, making more recipes until we get a recipe that would give us a light ale that is above 12 plus quantity or quality and if you notice guys the icon right here uh i only used for uh pale malt and uh the color is a little light compared to ali by two which i used uh, 10 malts look at this if you see the difference right different colors all right uh, pretty much i got the gist of the game it's it's <laughs> i didn't notice that i've been playing the game for more than an hour now it's fun uh although uh it could use some uh, more uh, clarification on how what to do and stuff like that. But pretty much, it's, it's just easy to navigate. And now I wish we could reach the 12 quant quality of uh, light ale. But uh, that's fine. And uh, yeah, for more videos, you can look at the lower part of the screen. And again, thank you so much for hanging out. And if you're new, feel free to like and subscribe. And we always walk with patience and kindness because that's what love is. See you on the next video.